CareerLink offices like this one are busy helping the unemployed try to find jobs, yet they still need their benefits in order to pay bills. But even after the state hired 500 people to answer phones at the unemployment office, many folks still can't get help. Uh, my truck payment's past due. We're coming up on July. I guess I'm not going to be able to pay my rent. Laid-off veterinary assistant Heather DeNorcia was approved for unemployment in October, but the payments stopped earlier this month when Harrisburg's new unemployment system went online. A labor and industry customer service rep answered her call but could not help her. So they claim that they hired all these people, but everybody they hired, nobody can help anybody. You just get this ticket and that's it. Legislators are also frustrated, especially after labor and industry hired 500 employees to answer phones. So obviously that's an issue that, that we need to get resolved. Uh, you know, the department had a plan to resolve it. Clearly it's not fixed at this point. A labor and industry spokesperson says they are trying to work out glitches in the system, saying, quote, we are reviewing each case, though some cases that are more complex and require staff intervention may take longer for a response. Many claimants are getting messages like this, saying their claim is in progress even after they receive payments under the old system. How much of a hardship is this causing for you and your family? Well, right now, I can tell you I have 75 cents in my account. That is all I have. This is pretty terrifying stuff. <laughs> I, I've never been so scared and so angry before in my life. O'Neill is encouraging claimants with troubles to call their local legislator for help. Marie and Heather say they did that, but they are still waiting for their benefits. Reporting from Forest Hills, Paul Van Osdall, Pittsburgh's Action News 4.